Sugar Buggers, welcome back to the channel for possibly one of the most exciting things to happen this week. It is the official release of The Sims 4 Discover University trailer, and your girl is so excited. So after a few hours of crying, yes, it is true, because with every face cam video comes the struggle. Um, I didn't know how I was going to film this. So if you could take two seconds out of your day, let me know in the comments down below how does today's face cam look. Um, it would really help me like approve, improve in the future. So, um, also, side note, at the very end of this video, I will be revealing to you what was once inside this envelope and which university I was accepted into for the first time in the history of my existence. Did I get something so official? And uh, as you guys can see, I was pretty freaking excited. Like, <laughs> I ate the damn envelope, like, literally. Um, and uh, sorry about smacking you there. <laughs> you know, not really. But anyway, um, very excited to reveal that to you. A lot of you guys are guessing on Twitter what I was. Some of you got it right, some of you got it wrong, and uh, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and dive on in. I do have my handy dandy beats this time. I'm not actually using um, Juan's earbuds, but uh, yeah, if you guys were ever curious um, <laughs> how beats' is quality is, peep this. Yeah, peep this. I really don't even know what happened here. I only use these for editing, and uh, I've had them for two years straight, and we are literally like missing all aspects of what was supposed to be once a earphone, but anyways... <sighs> Let's go ahead and dive into this trailer because your girl is so freaking excited that I might just faint. So let me try to get these on. All right, looking like a freaking chia pet, and uh, there we go. Let's do it. So where, where do we go when everything feels like it just stays the same? Where do we go from here when everything is said and done? Oh, this is what we do. Okay, so let's pause the video. Um, excuse me, when's the release date? Where do I even begin? Okay, let's take it from the very, very tippy, 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 tippy top, and uh, we'll bring it on down. If I'm not looking at you in the eyes, I have, uh, <laughs> I have problems. No, but seriously though, I'm like getting used to the setup. We got a big old screen, and I got to remember to look at the black dot because that's you. That's you, my friend. Okay, so here we go. Starting off with, obviously, a brand new sport to the game, soccer. If you guys don't know, I am a huge fan of soccer. I personally don't play, but, like, my entire family is, so that is really, really cool. I love that a lot. Also, peeping the new hairstyles, and I think that's even a new um, a tattoo, which is kind of cool, too. And let's just move on a little bit more. The most obvious thing that we knew from the leak was bicycles. I cannot believe bicycles are here before cars. Like, that kind of makes me feel a little kind of I don't know it makes me feel a little weird actually I, I thought for sure we would have cars with this expansion um but I am excited for some form of transportation other than a broomstick because let's be real you know um but I love I love I love the bike the bike is really cool he's got his hand his helmet on so we're obviously concerned about safety here uh super excited and um this girl I love her and the music you guys have to watch this trailer it's amazing oh mascots apparently are a thing so we have a bre bre Bright, Brightchester and Foxbury. So we got the Foxbury lobsters and the Brightchester dragons. And uh, I think they're absolutely amazing. I love how there's like a very 
definitive line here between the two different universities and i feel like the two they're like they're like one of them is more prestigious and like the other one is kind of more i don't know it seems more of like a like a mechanical institute of some kind but i'm really excited to see what the mascots like what part of the pack the mascot the mascots play in i also love all of the university garb i think that's really cool she's like i said earlier my favorite and apparently she goes to brightchester um, so they're giving speeches, right? We see that. And I'm wondering, oh, is she pregnant? <laughs> I'm just I'm just curious to what shall who or something. Uh, but um, I'm wondering if classes are a rabbit hole or they are actually fully functional. Rabbit hole would kill me like a rabbit hole would literally just slay me like it would just not be fun at all. Um, but we'll have to see. You know, I, I kind of keep my cool in these like reactions. Not really much of a reaction, which added uh, more drones. Didn't we get that and get famous? Just throwing that out there. Uh, but uh, this is cool. Apparently, this is some type of, you know, factory of some kind. Not really a factory, but they're creating robots. And I think that's really interesting. I haven't seen anything like this before, um, obviously, in The Sims 4. And I really love the detail. Like, this is such a cool image to me. I'm, I'm really intrigued. So let me just keep going. Um, anyway, the hairstyles are really cool. And this guy, I have a major crush on him. Also, peep. Okay, you guys, eyebrow piercing for the first time in a very long time, if ever. Um, we have facial pier piercings, and I'm really excited about that as well. Uh, apparently, you can make other things besides robots because there are some other little, um, nooks and crannies back there, some books to maybe study from. Probably decor, let's be honest. But, I mean, I don't know. I like this classroom. I love that. <laughs> He's so cute. And, bathroom stalls seriously bathroom stalls gone are the days that we have to make bathroom stalls out of half walls sorry i'm getting lost i'm like re-watching this real quick um okay cool this is also one of my favorite shots too apparently this is some sort of like on-campus hotspot that features uh what is it called uh, beer pong which is really cool i love the fact that we have a little more activities to do with our sims especially the young adults and uh it looks like we can get even an into a little bit of mischief i'm wondering if there's any new dishes i did notice uh this little platter here um but i, I see a lot of detail and a lot of what is in this particular trailer seems new to me I love like the hairstyles over here even the few that are over there um but this one kind of looks like the one that we actually got with I want to say realm of magic so I don't I'm not like too convinced that that one um is brand new a little study hall a little a little bit of keg I love that even the little uh project board is really cool and I'm assuming this might be <gasps> this is the dorm and there's some penguins I'm sorry I just committed to sin uh there is a penguins I'm so excited for this freaking penguin poster oh my god even the little oh my goodness you guys look at this okay so this little clutter area with all of these books we have like these tiny little cactus looking things um there is a lot of decor here and and don't think I missed the mini fridge. There's a mini fridge, possibly a brand new TV, whole bunch of uh, wall decor, and apparently you can stack your microwave on top of the mini fridge. I personally wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, this is so exciting. And shower woohoo. <laughs> you know, for a while my sims have been doing shower woohoo, but uh, just, you know, <laughs> hello there, wicked whims. But I'm really excited to see another woohoo spot return to the game. I like that. That's really exciting. And that little lobster peeping, that's me. Oh my god. Okay, so going back really quick, you guys, to this here. Um, I'm not really sure what this is supposed to be exactly, but I love the campus. The campus looks really interesting. I'm pretty sure a lot of these are going to be inevitably um, rabbit holes. Like, I, But you know what? I'm, I'm holding my tongue. I'm hoping that they're not. Um, maybe these are like where all the dorms are located, but uh, I love the fact that we can TP. I don't think we've ever been able to TP. Maybe in The Sims 3 and Halloween we were able to, but to be able to do this on the college campus, Campus. I'm really excited to see what the consequence would be cool all right and then I love the transition this is a really well done trailer this trailer is pretty boss this is apparently graduation day and more bing pong bing pong ping pong be a pong <laughs> okay Jen you got it all wrong anyway all right so I just wanted to go through that kind of like fast and slow with you guys um so far I'm pretty excited and I've been feeling lately like okay like a lot of people I'm kind of a little underwhelmed with the things that are in the sims 4 I think the big turnaround point not to like poop on anyone's parade but the big turnaround point for me was definitely 
on the island living um, for many reasons. And, that, and if you guys are interested in like my real honest thoughts about the Sims 4, let me know in the comments down below. I will do a video for you guys because I feel like, you know, it's that time. <laughs> um, but for what I see here, just by the trailer, like not letting in my, any of my other thoughts get in the way, um, I'm very excited and my hopes are up yet again. Um, I really love how detailed everything looks. It feels like this pack is rich. It's full of content. We've got a lot of zhoosh to it, but I'm hoping it isn't a fluff piece. I'm hoping that everything that I'm feeling like I'm going to get from this pack definitely rings true. And I'm so excited just to be able to dive in and actually get my hands on this. And I'm really hoping, I'm really hoping um, that this is some sort of like a turnaround point for The Sims 4 because I feel like lately a lot of us have been really sad and disappointed because it just doesn't feel like the excitement that we're feeling during these trailers are actually being lived up to post um, post production and in gameplay. So anyway, I'm super pumped. I'm very excited. My favorite thing in the entire world has to be the beer pong. I'm not gonna lie. Like that's pretty freaking exciting to me. I also love the the the, the toilet papering, the teeping for some damn reason, and of course the bicycles. Oh, and bathroom stalls, and actually just about everything in this pack. I'm really excited. So, um, with that said, if you guys are curious to know which uh, university your girl is attending, um, I'm actually going to, to be attending. Do 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 do. I'm so excited. <laughs> I feel like I'm on the more perfect show or something like. You are not the father, but uh, you might actually be. No, I'm just playing. Okay, but no, really, though. Here are my results. Oh, my God. It's just there's so many jokes that are coming to mind. But um, oh, my God, I'm about to rip this thing. It's all sorts of busted because I I, I bet they were like, mm, thought I'd do this a little more gracefully. But uh, <clears throat> on the count of three, one, two, three. I have been accepted to the University of Bright Chesta. If you guys are interested in knowing what this says, it says here. Um, can we can we see? Do you need to get me? A, do we need? To be, oh, we need to be real close. I need to sound you lap. All right. It says, Dear Urban Sims, congratulations on your admission to the University of Brightchester. I am delighted at the prospect of you joining our community this fall. With nearly a millennium of history and tradition, the University of Brightchester is the oldest university still teaching today. Originally built as a private academy, academy for vacationing royal families, the University of Brightchester has kept many of the original building details that Princess Cordelia helped design, along with a collection of her diaries about staying at the nearby castle. Today, the University of Brightchester aims to fulfill its mission, molding students into well into well-rounded, upstanding Sims. Please join us at youtube.com the Sims on October 22nd at 8 a.m. PT for your online orientation. We can't wait to meet you. Sincerely, Professor Pearson. Aw, well, guess who was late? Because it is now the 20 freaking third. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, I really liked that. That was super cute. When I got it, I squealed, but I didn't know what it was. Like, I didn't know what to expect. So everybody was like opening them online, you know, or on camera. And Jen's like opening it, it like literally I just got my paternity results or something but either way I was really excited to get this I know this might be hella cheesy um but I'm gonna frame this bitch like I'm framing it okay this is going on my wall next to my YouTube plaque we gotta pretend this is a real deal like mama I made it um but with that attitude, ultimately, um, I want to know what you guys are thinking about the Sims 4 Discover University. Please keep it classy, okay? Not trashy, um, but forever sassy. And I'm cool with that. But no, seriously, I, I, I'm excited. I'm excited. And I'm not trying to say too much because I just... I just don't want to be unexcited, you know? I'm really, university is just one of those packs that I feel like really changes the game in such a monumental way that I would really hope that they would get deliver, you know, as, as they have in the previous packs. And um, of course, oh, of course, what am I even talking about? Of course, that means the Foremans are returning, okay? Foremans are returning. I'm so freaking excited. And we are going to be focusing mostly on Finley Foreman, which she is the perfect age to head on into university. I'm wondering if she would be in Foxbury or Brightchester. I'm not sure yet. I'm kind of leaning towards Brightchester just because I feel from what I read on my acceptance letter that's on the floor um, that that would fit her better, even though she's like not royalty. But her family is, well, her grandparents are pretty like, you know, you know 
you know. So I feel like maybe that would be um, the best university for her. But again, I don't know. I don't know if you have to like apply. I have no idea what could happen. Um, so I'm, I'm really excited mostly just for the returns of the four men's and what that gameplay is going to look like. So with that said, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this trailer reaction video here. If you guys have anything that you would like to share with me regarding like the four men's or even again, Discover University as a whole, um, I would be more than happy to know. And also, in case you didn't, let me know what you guys think about today's um, like webcam, face cam situation. And yeah, I'm going to cool down. I've been stressing out. Lord knows I need to take a break. But um, yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you for hanging out with me here today and uh, <laughs> waiting for me to finally get this video up. I love you guys so freaking much to the moon and to the back and to the tip of my butt crack. I will see you. No, we're not. That's not going to be the new intro. But if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do, boo. Don't forget to go ahead, comment, rate, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below where the sun does not shine. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys. Where do we go when